Hi, I'm Stevie French. Today at the V&A, at the opening of Frida Kahlo making herself up. The exhibition reimagines Carlo's home on the outskirts of Mexico, where she was born, lived, and died, creating a journey through her childhood, family life, and marriage. It's almost a reintroduction, a personal, intimate account of one of the most significant artists and women of the 20th century. So this exhibition builds on the exhibition that was opened in the Museo Frida Kahlo in 2012 after the discovery in 2004 of the personal possessions and wardrobe of Frida Kahlo. And then the V&A has expanded on this exhibition and on, alongside the wardrobe and all of these personal possessions, the V&A has incorporated photography and um, other material that allow us to understand the context of Frida Kahlo and her allegiance to her Mexican roots and to her heritage. So this is what we're trying to provide visitors, that context that they don't have here, but they, they did have in Mexico. So in 1957, um, after the death of Diego Rivera, who was the famous muralist painter and also the husband of Frida Kahlo, he asked for these a number of trunks, cupboards and a bathroom to be sealed and these uh, spaces in the blue house where Frida had lived most of her life they contained all, about over 300 personal possessions 6,000 photographs and 22,000 documents of different sorts from political to letters so it's only in 2004 where these trunks and cupboards and bathroom are reopened and they are rediscovered and they allow us to give they allow us to, to rediscover the artist herself as well because they had never been known before and they are going to be exhibited at the V&A and to UK audiences and international audiences for the first time now at this exhibition. It really is an intimate portrayal of her and it's, it's the closeness that we are able to have through the display of these objects but in the same way we also see other objects that refer to more tragic aspects of her life like the corsets which she has embellished and painted for example with a hammer and sickle showing her communist beliefs or with the drawing of a fetus as well referring to the miscarriages that she suffered as a result of her accident yet these objects become a second skin they become uh, something that allowed her to transcend uh, these struggles that were caused by the physical injuries of the accident that she suffered at the age of 18. Through the photographs, her makeup, and the incredible display of her clothes here at the V&A, you really get a sense of Frida Kahlo, the woman, the wife, and of course, the artist. The exhibition runs until the 4th of November, so come on down to check it out. Thanks for watching. See you soon. Thank you.